Hey, good evening, friends. Just a quick news update, right? Oh, I'm distracted. My music stayed on this time, which is unusual. So in the news, scientists discover underwater fresh water out in the oceans. Now, all ocean mining aside, <laughs> the article is like half true. Kind of expected because the aquifers that cross this continent deep underground have a life of their own. A billion year planetary life where continents rolled on top of each other and such. So that's a bit of planetary news. Uh, another little bit of planetary news. Russia's finishing up massive Arctic oil drilling. Just massive. It's a huge complex large enough that they built a ship with nuclear power generators on it to go up there and power what they've been building up in the middle of the Arctic. That's what uh, our Secretary of State was over in Russia negotiating so quietly for months on end is how Exxon and his partners, Halliburton, everybody involved in the oil industry, would and could get involved. So that's been going on for decades. It goes back to the commissioning of that nuclear generator put on a ship that was destined to be a commercial operation. But it was done under the guise and under the funding, oddly, of the uh, Soviet Union and those nuclear friends. It's a small world up there, very small world, supply and demand type of thing. So, that's another piece of news out there, right? Arctic Ocean drilling. And there's another surprising piece of news about the Arctic melt and what it's going to look like, is if scientists are really surprised by this. You might be surprised by seeing some of this in the media. You might be shocked by this. But these things come from models that, that just got updated recently just got refreshed studying i call it earth sciences it is life sciences it is what uh, data that goes back decades and generations and the information we've built on top of it so that's what exxon is harvesting in the north sea for us that is part of an energy future oil and gas you can find the videos about those pipelines and and a lot of offshore information out on YouTube. Uh, you can see the ships being built. The Scandinavian countries, European Union countries are heavily involved in planning for deep sea, deep ocean mining. They're help building the ships or design and engineer the ships that are being built in Asia to do these things. So everything's been offshored. It's a global production world. Parts are built in, in Finland or somewhere and shipped. Uh, engineering and installations going on and deep sea submersibles from nations that are allies of ours come in and do the work. So where is our nation on this high tech adventure? Maybe there's a few states involved in it. So another piece of news, just, you know, because we're doing news in the dark, is a defunding of stem cell research. Now, only an insidious group of people would do this. They truly would. That type of research is our future. No gods involved. Stop that. 
that research needs to go on. That's the research that keeps a diabetes mellitus patient alive. So there you go. Little Saturday evening news updates. The rest of the planet's burning. And woman, you have rights. Take them.